In this video, I'm going to share one of my favorite features of Google Docs. So I often work in Google Docs. They can get often long, and I'm often doing a lot of this, a lot of scrolling with the mouse and trying to, you know, find where where is that thing that I'm looking for. Uh, this is a headache. This wastes a lot of time. This can be lots of frustrating, you know, lots of frustrating for people. So here's the thing that I strongly recommend is that the first thing you want to do is whenever you get into a Google Doc is come up to view and show outline. I typically always have this open. This is an essential for me. This helps me make through uh, documents and stuff. And as you notice, it gives you this outline and there's all these headings. Uh, for folks that are wondering, I took the full text of W. Uh, W.E.B. Du Bois's uh, The Souls of Black Folk, and that's what we're looking at here. It's a public domain text, and um, I wanted to use it as a way for us to see, uh, you know, it's it's a, two, what is it, 144 pages, right? So if I'm trying to look for things, or if I'm looking for particular chapters, what's really nice here is if I use the headings feature within this document, it means it will build out this outline. So in this case, you know, this is the, the first heading and it is a heading of, these are all defaulted to headings of three. But maybe if I have certain headings and subheadings, right? If I use the structure uh, under this particular section, I can do heading one, heading two. So if I set this up as heading one, and then I come down and I set this up as heading two, Notice now that it's indented. So this is letting me know, like if I'm creating, if I'm creating these types of headings, um, it lets me know that, oh, this, this area is a subsection of this area. It's not really in this book that I'm using, but in general, this is how you want to think about it is how do I organize my stuff and use the headings feature so that I can more quickly move through this document. I can see how it's coming into shape. Right. And I can use that to be like, oh, you know, where do I need to go next? Well, let me jump back up here um, or actually, no, I need to go check out here. And so the beauty of just being able to jump around a document more quickly to being able to really use the uh, the headings feature in this outline feature can help save you. I, I know for me, it saved me days of my time of doing this, of scrolling or trying to like, you know, grab the, you know, drag the, the bar here and figure out where things are. Um, so I can't emphasize it enough. The outline feature is your friend. Using headings to kind of help build out that outline is really important um, and it will save you a lot of time. So I hope this is helpful. Let me know if you have questions.